Long ball forward and it could be an effective one because it's gathered up by Mark Pugh, although the flag has belatedly gone up. Pugh walked it into the net, but it is not going to count. Good call there by Horwood. So well held up by Brown. And then James Brown initially appeared as if he was waiting for support to arrive. Decided to go it alone. He certainly wasn't far away here. Full stretch when he hit it, but off the bar. Intercepted by Monkhouse. Brown has uh, set off on a searching run and ended it with a stunning strike. Hartlepool United lead just past the half hour mark. And James Brown on target for the first time in League One this season. His third goal of the campaign in total, and it's a top quality one. A bit of space here for Pugh. Still Mark Pugh. Driven cross is partially cleared. Went back into the danger area by Robinson though. Reflection on the shot takes it into the side netting. And behind for the corner. Anton Robinson in behind the Hartlepool defence here. On the press again. Feeney. In towards Tyler. He turns and gets his shot away. Of course, have seen their top scorer Josh McCoy depart for Millwall. Taylor, one of those trying to fill his boots. Hartlepool have conceded just six away league goals all season. That is the size of Bournemouth's task. They'll try and find a way past this defence and rescue something this afternoon. They might do so here, but Jason Pierce got it all wrong. Wonderful position he found himself in. But just couldn't angle his body correctly to get his shot goalwards. There's Pugh. Right, the defence backpedalling. Still Mark Pugh. Brings the save from Jake Keane. Again, the goalkeeper probably saw this fairly late with two defenders in front of him. There's Archer. To Anton Robinson. Robinson's effort just loops up through to Keane though. It's only Bournemouth's second home league defeat of the season. Hartlepool win by a goal to nil.